I think it's on. Hi. Hello. All right. Today we are gonna. We, my husband and I are doing a Google Hangout because he just showed me <laughs> the coolest tool ever. I'm so excited. Was I excited earlier, Pete, about that? We're really excited. Yes. Yeah, because I'm a I'm a web designer and I create Google. Excuse me. I create WordPress websites. And we've been trying to figure out how to, what, what have we been trying to figure out, Pete? Um, just a, a simple, you would think it'd be a simple thing is to allow people to download MP3s from a website. Because I have some music I want to share with others and it was frustrating because it, you think it would be, in today's age of technology, be easy, but <laughs> well, it wasn't. Maybe, it's, so. it's easy to find plugins that will play your mp3s but we couldn't find anything that was allowing you to download it except when it looked really ugly because it had like the whole url that you had to click on and, and it kept crashing so anyway you just kept you just kept plugging away at it and basically you found you found um a solution didn't you well yeah i got thinking about about a year ago uh, uh, a co-worker introduced me to um oh what's it called I forgot what it's called. Well, why don't you show us your website first? Okay, it's uh, SoundCloud. That's what it is. Um, okay, you're going to have to walk me through this because. Oh, on the left-hand side, there's a yeah. there's an uh, an icon or button that says screen. Uh huh. Okay, so here's his website. All right, we had created a page for my music I had done years ago when I was in college. Michelle did a great job setting this up. Uh, three albums. I wanted it to be very simple for people to read about each album. And let's say, for example, you go into this album, Higher Ground. It uh, explains the album. And down below, each song has a player. And so this part was uh, rather easy once we got it set up. I mean, you could physically listen to each song. It's in high quality and so forth. But there was no way of, uh, of, of be, being able to let people download these songs for their own keep. Um, well, I'm sure there are ways, but we just got frustrated <laughs> because it was more difficult. So anyway, here's what I did. After the uh, other plugins did not work or we had difficulty with that, I thought, hey, wait a minute. What about this? Um, uh, this, can you see that? Yeah. Sure. Okay. What is that? Uh, What's the website? This is SoundCloud, S-A-O-U-N-D-C-L-O-U-D uh, dot com. Okay, and then you just create an, is this free? Yeah, it is up to a certain limit. It's like you're allowed so many minutes of music for free. You can buy a bigger storage unit, but this is a cool thing. I had set this up a year ago because I had a couple of radio commercials I wanted to share with other people. And I thought, wait a minute, let me check into this account that I created last year. The cool thing is, it allowed me to upload all my songs. And if you look closely, every song has this download button. And as soon as I click on that, it downloads immediately to my laptop as an MP3 and no errors, nothing. That is awesome. So, yeah, so see, I've got, oh, on the bottom right here, do you see over here? I have my three albums categorized, so if I want to just open the album, um, higher ground. Watch this. There's the entire album. That's awesome. So you can play the entire album also without having to click on each song. That's correct. You can listen to the whole album up here at the top, and then while you're listening down here, you can decide which song you want to download. Okay. Awesome. That is so, awesome. Yeah, and what I did was I just used the basic links from my WordPress website setting to this account. And so how did you actually do the link of like one of the songs? Like you click on the song and it gives you the link in the URL? <clears throat> yes, basically that's what I did. Let me go back here. Like for example, uh, I put in this word you see here. Mm -hmm. This is back to the website, uh, my website. I hit, I typed in the word download and then I just went in and used the, uh, the link. Right. What do you call that? And uh, uh, and then SoundCloud, SoundCloud offered a special link for every song I uploaded, so it had its own link. So it gives you what that link is, and then you just put that in there. Yeah, for example, I guess I can do it here. Watch, I'm gonna, here's a song, Higher Ground. I can listen to it here, or I can download it. I hit right. download. Right. It. It's going to go right to SoundCloud, and watch, it'll pull that one song up by itself. And then you can download it. Okay. And I hit the download here. Awesome. That's awesome. 
And I also like how, how you had on your website, if you went to the, all the way to the bottom, because you wanted people to be able to read your story behind the song, because some of them right. have some personal stories on there. And then at the very bottom, they could right. actually click, listen to the entire album. And right, then and I click on that, and it goes... To the album. Free. It goes back to the entire album that at the is top. That awesome. And then you can still choose the songs here separately. Okay, um, I'll put a link of that on my blog. And uh, yeah, this should be something that you should be able to offer to people, um, you know, whether it's an MP3 of any sort, um, just use, utilizing this technology. So if you have any ideas, anybody that's watching this has any ideas on anything that might be better or any way that we could improve this, please let us know. So, okay, awesome. All right. All right, thanks a lot, honey. All right, bye. Bye.